Hi, this is Fire India. This is me as an artist. So when I first started out in art, I uh, first started working with oil paint, which has been amazingly difficult, but I'm grateful for that. Uh, watercolor and wash, which is a lot easier to work with. But as I progressed and um, tried all the different types of mediums, digital has been the one that's easier, more efficient, and it is the industry standard. first got me into illustration and concept work was when I was in working in and out of jobs. I started quality assurance at a very prominent video game company. And then from there, I was able to learn the ins and outs of the company uh, from production to concepts, developing the characters from 3D, 2D, and I was able to find an interest working digitally. And then from there, I, I started to develop more um, interest and so uh, the process usually starts even before digital. It just anywhere uh, an idea strikes you from you, you know you have a napkin in front of you and some pencils and you just start going like when something strikes. Um, but now that I'm usually in front of my computer mostly all the time, um, it just I just jump right into digital. Uh, it, Great thing about digital is you can always put one on top of the next. Not to say the process is uh, difficult with paper and pencil, it, it just alleviates all of that waste. Uh, so as I've worked on through the years, everything has been digital. The great thing about that is just you can see how it looks like in color. You can already throw value on it. You can make changes on the fly uh, working digitally. You can even see how it looks like in different colors even before it hits the final eyes and all with a snap. So it's, it's a lot easier. You can definitely um, get ideas across a lot faster digitally. Um, but then again, you'll never know when an idea will strike. Like I said, it's, it can come from anywhere. So you're not going to have your tablet your, with you everywhere, but you're, you can always carry a book and a pencil with you. Um, and that's just to be able to get some ideas down immediately. I think like any artist that like first starts, they, they want that big studio. And at this point, I'm not to saying I'm, I'm doing terrible, but I, I love my progress and I want to see where I can go. And I'd love to be in those studios, but I think to be in a studio in general would be great, like a video game studio, filming studio, animation. Um, if, if it need be, man, I, I, they need me to paint the box, put me the best damn box I'll ever see. So, I just want to be able to be a part of that creative process. Starting the day, I, I told myself I got give myself six months. But I think I'm at less than six months right now. I got four months to to accomplish that goal. Had it not been for the military, I would not be on this.
this artistic journey. Um, after my stint at the video game company, I just I had to get back into school. Uh, so I enrolled um, after my enlistment of three years in the U.S. Army and went right back into it. And I think it was great because it wasn't just paying for school, it was also learning leadership skills, working as a team, and that was something that was definitely invaluable. And I've met a few people along the way in the military. Um, a couple of guys had brought together this idea to work with veterans with PTSD involving virtual reality. As with what's been going on with quarantine and people being home more often, but we're also thinking about service members who are either overseas and not unable to see their families even safely at a, at a distance, so we wanted to be able to um, help alleviate that and um, assist them in the best way possible. All right, so after all this, I hope to still land this big art studio from video games to film, uh, work on something great for the public to see. Uh, but in the end, I, I think I ultimately want to have my own art studio. A couple of artists, working together and be able to create something on our own. For more of my work, you can check me out on ArtStation or on Instagram at pdivart. Thanks for watching. Cause you said blue steel, I'm just like, it's in my head. <laughs> <laughs> that's, that's, that's all I see.